Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Solidacy and today we're continuing with the Not So Berry Challenge. Today's episode is all about revenge because last episode we learned that our love, our promised, our boyfriend, our soulmate, Ross, got married. We didn't even know. We had just come back from a date with him. Possibly the day before. I can't quite remember. Okay, so first things first. When do you have work? Two days. Excellent. When do you have work? 24 hours. And Luna, when do you have work? Oh, you got work in four hours. Oh my gosh. Uh... We better get you up. Uh, well, someone was trying to do something. Alright, Luna, up you get. Come down to the kitchen. Brew a pot of the run oolong. Griselda, what are you up to? Watching a bit of telly. That's fine. Actually, I think... We need to work on your singing skills. So for the moment, I think we will actually get you to do some singing. While we wait for everyone to head to work. That's right. Nothing planned today. It's all good. So we had a suggestion from Kelly and from Sweetie that we need to get our revenge on Ross. Specifically, his new partner. One of the th suggestions was to befriend them and then kill the partner or maybe kill Ross as well. So don't you worry, I've been thinking and plotting and I have come up with an idea. For the moment though, I just want to get Luna off to work. Now, how long is that tea going to last? Four hours. When do you have work? Three hours. So I think the only thing we needed to do for Luna is reach level 10, which it looks like she might be heading for a promotion either today or tomorrow. Perhaps we should have her have a little nap. Wait, is someone already sleeping on the couch? Oh, please put your head up the other. Oh, I was hoping they'd snuggle head to head. That's still pretty cute. Whoop. That's still pretty cute though. Look at that. They're both curled up the same. Come on. I want her to go to work. Whoop, George is woken up. I realize, what the heck? <laughs> Who's that sleeping on my couch? Oh, she's still got an excitement from the woohoo we had with Jeffrey. What? Work starts in an hour. Do you want to come grab another one of those? Fill that up, for George. Uh-oh, now she's hungry. It's probably... Oh, no, too late to have a quick snack. She's off to work. Let the plotting begin. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is go into build mode. Because I had the most wicked idea... And it's only through the Black Widow challenge <laughs> that these sort of ideas come to me. Okay, now we need a basement. Basement. Let's make it about that big to start with. Next thing we need is some stairs leading down. Right. Yeah, OK. 
Okay, that, that doesn't look suspicious at all. Nope. Delete a few things. And now we need to put some walls up because I had this plan of what I wanted to do. Because there's not going to be a killing basement down here at all. I don't know what you're talking about. Whoops, wrong thing. Windows. Wait, did we get glass roofs in the latest update? Where's my glass roof? Oh, I wanted to investigate the glass roofs. All right, windows. One of those nice big ones that go all the way. Yeah. There we go. Right. Don't worry, there is a plan. Now I need to Delete that. Now, what's that door? Can we get that door that's a bookcase? Not yet. Okay. Now we can. So we want it facing this way. Bookcase. There we go. Right. Now for the fun bit. What do we do with this room? First, I want a wall here. Then we're going to extend this out. I don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six-ish or so. Uh, get another door. Okay, that doesn't work. Okay, if that's the door, we need a wall there, wall there, bring this room in and extend that one out, that's about the same size, yes, okay. Okay, getting somewhere. Where's the bad light? There we go, light there. Okay, looking good. Suppose we should get one there too. Now the devious part is I'm making these rooms glass for a reason. Oh, I forgot to leave room for a door. And a door. Oh. 
Oh, what? Hang on. Move that window to there. Oh, okay. Hang on. Hang on. We'll just extend this one that way. There we go. Now. There. Does it look sus at all? What are you talking about? Oh, is that some of my new paving? All right, let's get some dank rustic brick down here. And some concrete walls. Where's the concrete? Now, this is where the evil comes in because in this room we are going to have a fridge a toilet nice green toilet and a sink and a bed albeit a bad bed but a bed nonetheless. Okay, so that's that bit done. Now, to disguise it. I wonder if I'll need move objects on. Do, 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 do. What was make bigger again? That one. Don't know what you're talking about. It's your average, everyday, run of the mill cactus garden. Nothing sus here at all. Got to be some more cactuses. Ha ha! Some of those. Now, do you understand the sandy desert floor? The cactus is going help. Don't come in here. Don't know what this is, but I like it. Get another one of those. Some more of that. What's that? Oh, interesting. It's a beautiful cactus garden. It's not hiding anything at all.
No, I think that's a bit too much. <laughs> Creepy thorns, it's just a bit too much. All right, how does that look? That looks good. Yep, just your average everyday cactus garden. Now, we have to hide the steps somehow. Uh, Oh, that's going to snap, isn't it? Wall decorations? That's going to... They're going to snap too, aren't they? Yeah. What if we just built... What if we built... Uh... Semi-permanent walls. That will get rid of the stairs. I knew it. Yeah. We're just going to have to hope no one notices. Maybe if we put a fence around. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good idea. Fence. Uh, oh, we need the wall there. Something that looks like it's supposed to be there, but isn't suspicious. <laughs> then maybe if we put... Yeah, there's blinds there. We'll get rid of these. Oh, that looks like a door though. We need a... Curtain in front of that door. There. Now, will she still be able to get through there? <clears throat> Let's test it out. Uh, can you come here? Jog here. Stop singing. Right, it's working. She can get there. Excellent. Okay, so let's go back upstairs and we will lock door for everyone but Griselda for the moment. And now let's go find Ross. Right, uh, let's let's start at Willow Creek because we don't know his partner yet, so we need to find them. Okay, we got not there, not there, not there, no, no, no. Ha ha, ha 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 ha. Found you. Now where are you? 
Waterside Warble. And your name is Arnav. Right. Waterside Warble. Okay, so let's have you get dressed in your finest. Don't eat the food. Griselda. Let's change your outfit into your finest, uh, I don't know, party wear. I'm impressed. I am impressed with this. That is not going to look sus at all, Griselda. Jeez. Eat that. <laughs> and hurry up about it, because we've got somewhere to be. Travel. Okay, waterside warble. Waterside warble. You better look out, Arnav. We are coming for you. Right. Where is he? No. The thing lied. He's not here. Maybe he's in the world somewhere. That's not... No. Aha. Uh, watch performance. Lamina? Yeah. a bit faster, please, Griselda. Alright, what kind of introduction shall we give? Uh, what about just a funny introduction? Hello? Uh, ask about day. Share some photos. Check this out, this is my boyfriend. We've known each other since we're in high school. Wait, I know that guy. Discuss interests. Oh my god, what if he turns out... No, don't go home! Griselda! Ask about career. <laughs> Ask about another sim. What do you think of a man Ross? Oh, Arnav is an assistant at high school. <gasps> Ross is my ball and chain. We're married. What? Yell at him. <gasps> How did that happen? Get to know. Oh! What's that for? Have a sim reach. Luna reached her max skill. Oh my god. Let's have a look at that when we get home. Get to know. He's a bro. Oh, we're a bro. Let's have a gossip. Oh, he's gone. All right, we'll go home too. Oh no, poor Griselda. She's dying. Girl, come on, quick, get upstairs. Revenge isn't easy. Sing in the shower and then go to sleep. In the meantime, Luna! Well done, we can read about you now. 
<laughs> so she was promoted to Space Ranger. Luna has been promoted. She will now make an additional 125 simoleons per hour for a grand total of 422. She has received the following bonus, 4,567 simoleons, the Apollo rocket ship, and some new clothes for work. Oh, this looks tasty. Who made that? Griselda. Ooh. Let's put that in the fridge for later. Now, while Griselda's recovering, I'll just fill you in on what's the plan. Okay, so the plan is to invite Ross over for a friendly barbecue. In the meantime, I think Luna deserves a night out. So let's have you socialise. Let's have you... I don't know. Go on a mini vacation with Gracie. I wish we could go there, but it's just a rabbit hole. Okay, so the plan is to invite Ross over for a lovely barbecue. And then we will invite over Arnav and take them to the revenge, I mean, guest room to stay the night. Meanwhile, locking the door. Do you know what would be really funny though? Because Griselda has to marry a neat sim and Ross wasn't a neat sim. <laughs> Wouldn't it be weird if Arnav turned out to be the neat sim and we accidentally kill Ross and marry Arnav? Oh no, Luna passed out. I mean, Griselda passed out. What did you get up to? Alright, you had your shower and you went to the toilet. You can go to sleep. Oh, Luna's taken some photos. Oh, she's having a nice time at the spa. Luna's new skill in wellness will allow her to perform various yoga poses meditate and give a massage wow oh new recipes unlocked at higher levels sounds like she's having the time of her life okay charlie what oh the time is gone we have officially finished working on luna she's reached level 10 of her skill so now we only have griselda to concentrate on why are you... Oh yeah, on vacation. I thought, why is she greyed out? Is she a ghost? Oh no! Okay. Uh, so she's all set for a promotion as well. What skill level is she actually? Level 5? Wow. But she needs to take care of herself too. Okay. So we've got everything set up for our revenge on Ross. How dare he do that to us? We were promised to him. All set, ready to go for the next episode. And I think we'll just get you to play some Sims. Play Sims forever. Alright, so we might end this part here. Please leave your feedback, comments and suggestions down below. Aha. Hit that like button. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Wahahaha. Bye.